Good morning students. You have read about interrogative sentences. Today we will read about question tag. What is a question tag? So question tag is a short phrase in which auxiliary verb is there and a pronoun is there. And in some cases note is also used along with this auxiliary verb. But that is used in contracted form. So we start with sentences with auxiliary verbs. So before starting this, uh, I'd like to explain why did we require to have a question tag. So question tag is used in order to get someone to agree with our statement. Or you can say we use this question tag in order to have a confirmation about our statement. Yani ki, जो हमने स्टेटमेंट दी उसके बारे में कंफर्मेशन लेने के लिए हम क्वेश्चन टैग का इस्तेमाल करते हैं और इसमें हम हेल्पिंग वर्ब और साथ में प्रोनाउन का यूज करते हैं तो हम यहां पे नोट का इस्तेमाल करते हैं और वो कब करते हैं जब हमारा स्टेटमेंट है अगर पॉजिटिव होता है तो हम इसके साथ नोट ऐड कर देते हैं लेकिन वो कॉन्ट्रैक्टेड फॉर्म में कॉन्ट्रैक्टेड यानी कि सिकुड़ा हुआ रूप होता है जिसे हम स्पोकन इंग्लिश में टाइम बचाने के लिए हम इसका इस्तेमाल करते हैं सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद एग्जांपल्स ही इज रीडिंग ए बुक सो यू कैन से दिस इज ए पॉजिटिव स्टेटमेंट एंड व्हाट हैव वी डन एट द एंड ऑफ द स्टेटमेंट वी हैव इंसर्टेड ए कोमा हमने यहां पे कोमा का इस्तेमाल किया आफ्टर दैट वी हैव ब्रॉट दिस हेल्पिंग वर्ब हियर is but since this is a positive statement we have added not along with this but not is in contracted form so it will be called isn't and then we have used this pronoun he here and sign of interrogation at the end second example they are not working since this is a negative statement so we will have a positive question tag so here not can't be seen there because it is not used here so are they okay here it was a positive statement so the question tag was negative but here the statement is not positive it is negative so question tag here is positive clear after that one more example ram has done it so comma hasn't he since it is a positive statement so question tag will be negative so hasn't he clear but we will see here that here ram was there but we have used he for ram suppose had it been there sita then we would have used see here clear now we will have some examples of sentences without auxiliary verbs. Sentences without auxiliary verbs. Let's have an example. He sang a song. So here no auxiliary verb has been used. So what will we do? He sang a song, didn't he? Here, second form of the verb has been used. Wheresoever second form of verb is used, we will use helping verb did. Since it is a positive statement, the question tag is in negative. One more example.
he sings a song so this is also an example where no helping verb or auxiliary verb is there the first form of the verb has been used yani ki verb ki first form ka istemal kiya gaya hai so what shall we use doesn't he since it is a positive statement so question tag is in negative so doesn't he so uh, if the first form of the verb is used we will use does or do so does has been used because of he along with he we use does so these were two examples of sentences without auxiliary verbs now we will we'll have some more examples imperative sentences this is an example of an imperative statement <coughs> imperative sentence since it is a positive imperative sentence we can use will you or want you now let's have another example here we have taken two examples the first example is here go to your class this is a positive imperative uh, sentence so in case of positive imperative uh, sentence we can have both ways will you or won't you the question tag may be positive or may be negative but here the example is of negative imperative sentence so if negative imperative uh, sentence is there we will have a positive question tag so is it clear to you now we will have some four examples sentences with demonstratives demonstratives demonstrative pronoun this is a book here isn't it that is my bag isn't it yahan par hum kya dekhte hain ki demonstrative pronoun has been used so in this case this is a book isn't it so instead of using this we use here it okay in next case that has been used that is my bag so question tag since it is a positive statement question tag obviously will be negative isn't so no issue in using isn't but here also it has been used so this you have to keep in mind okay so now i'll explain more 